our good friend, Mel Gosling from the uh, New Hampshire Food Bank, the executive director, Ooh. joining us on the show once again. Good morning, Mel. Hey, Nazi. Hi, Maya. Hi. All right, so you guys have launched a new campaign called the Mission Possible Challenge. What's the goal of this challenge, Mel? Well, we've got a huge opportunity. We're still in the middle of our capital campaign for our new facility, and um, this is really going to help us try to tie that up. So we have the opportunity to raise about $700,000 and if we're able to achieve that, um, we've got some generous sponsors that will match it by three hundred and fifty thousand wow. dollars. So that will really help us get to our five million dollar goal. So we're we're very excited. So how can businesses and individuals help out? You know, it's it's really about uh, going to either our website, which is nhfoodbank.org, or New Hampshire Catholic Charities, which is nh-cc.org. Gives a little bit of an explanation about our mission, mission possible challenge. Um, if you want to come by for a tour of the facility to sh so we can show you exactly, you know, how your your donation will help us um, better serve those in need in New Hampshire. Now, I, I've, I've seen, you know, video on the news of, of your current facility, but here's the question. How does the new food bank facility help you serve the community better than the facility that you're in right now? Well, uh, it, you know, it, to put things into perspective, our perishable capacity, so our refrigerator alone is has the full capacity capacity of our old facility. We've been able to part, better partner with our grocery uh, chains and start recovering uh, perishable items. So we needed the capacity to be able to do that. What has the New Hampshire Food Bank seen so far this year in like demand for food and services? Well, we continue to see about a 20% growth in our distribution. Oh, wow. um, and that's been sort of almost a five-year cycle for us. Mm -hmm. But you have to understand, that's only based on the, the food that we're putting out. Um, if you went to the facility now, I'll be honest, the, the shelves are pretty bare. Yeah. Um, we're sitting probably, we'll probably have about five or six days of inventory for the state. Wow. Um, you know, if we had more food, I can tell you those numbers would probably be up in the 30s or 40 percent uh, so we're maintaining but again you know every day new people are, are added to uh, to the lines at the food pantries and shelters throughout the state listen Mel I just want to say thank you you know on behalf of the citizens in New Hampshire for what you do for what the food bank does and I really I hope everybody gets in on this mission possible challenge well you guys have been a great partner to us for years and you know been out there in food drives and that yep. and and you know firsthand it's yeah. it's all of us teaming up to make a difference here in the state. Yeah, it is. So thank you and thank you to your listeners. Again, yeah. we yeah. wouldn't be able to do what we do without generous support. And give out that website one more time. It's nhfoodbank.org or nh-cc.org and you can read all about the challenge. Excellent. Excellent. Listen, Mel, thank you and uh, we'll talk again soon, all right? Now, Maya, thank you guys. You're great partners in this. Our pleasure, Mel.